So in the last week, a little indie horror game has been sweeping all of gaming YouTube, and that game goes by the name of The Mortuary's Assistant. You see, this game is based off real-life paranormal events that apparently happened within a mortuary and might actually cause you to be haunted. At least, that's what the disclaimer to the game says. And I know people love watching me be absolutely terrified for my life, and all things paranormal scare the ever-living crap out of me, so I figured this game would be perfect for both me and my fans. It's only about an hour and a half long, so we might be able to even get it done in one part, which would be super nice, but we won't know that until we try, because if we're being entirely real, just because it takes somebody else an hour and a half doesn't mean it'll take me, because I, uh, move a little bit slow. Well, let's get to moving a little bit quicker here, guys, and get directly into the mortuary's assistant. What you're about to experience is based on real paranormal events. Research of the occult has shown that heightened moments of emotion, such as fear, can encourage the manifestation of hauntings. Good. If after playing this game, you experience abnormal happenings around your home or have sudden changes in the behavior of yourself or loved ones, reach out immediately to your local church or paranormal investigators. I don't think I have either of those things locally. I'm definitely not reaching out to a church. So <laughs> we get haunted, we get haunted, baby. New shifts, all right. Nothing to, nothing to do but to get into a new shift here, baby. Just time to go to work. I can't tell if I should be playing with a mouse and keyboard or controller here, but I guess we'll, we'll find out. We'll see what works best for us. 1990, I'm two years old. Connecticut, okay? I mean, I might have been in Connecticut. I live in New Hampshire. Uh, feel, There's nothing but... disturbing about it. It's just but... that it... Oh, this is definitely indie game animation. Yeah, you've come so far. Yeah, I mean, you've come so far, but you still have side banks, so let's work on that. Told me what's next. Will you get a job where you are, or...? They actually have everyone they need but my old teacher, Mr. Dump Is that who I'm playing? His office to finalize my internship there. At a mortuary. I remember you mentioning him. Where's he located? Are you moving away from me? Yeah, I mean, with the way you look, I mean, I think you'd belong in a mortuary already. So maybe it's time we get away from her. Riverfields. Oh, Rebecca, I don't like that. What's wrong with Riverfields? It's Connecticut. How dangerous could it be? Just be worried people about you. make up stories. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. And we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. No one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. Well, how would you embalm a ghost body? But I... Wanted to give you the arm animation is sending me, dude. The way just like the the, <laughs> the super hard. It's an indie game. I shouldn't shit on it. I I don't know if I want that. Just take it, please. Yeah, that's right. Push Christianity out of your life. Her shoulders are so far back. Don't take it. Do I have an option not to take it? And we took it. All right. All right. Enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. When is all this happening? When do you start? I actually already started. For a few weeks now. I <laughs> I was right. Are we, are we, are we following that fire truck? This game saw, saves automatically. You have reached a checkpoint whenever you see this icon. Got it. Oh, that means I'll probably die. River Fields Mortuary, baby. Let's get it. Do we get to work the night shift at a mortuary? Oh, not haunted at all, baby. All right, here we go. I'm like low key cute for 1998. Ah, what up legs? Hit it with that. Hit that Michael Jackson slide around one time. Hit that Michael Jackson slide around one time. All right, all right, all right. Let's take this seriously. Let's take this seriously. Let's go and bomb some bodies. What to expect after death? Nothing. I can take this cup? Oh, baby. Immersion. All right, we're gonna... Yeah! Okay, wait, hold up. I wanna throw this... Hopefully the ghost will trip over that. Uh, big old yellow notice. Rebecca, one last thing I forgot to give you. Uh, please grab a pencil from my desk and sign thanks. Zoe... P.S. Good luck. I don't think I needed good luck. All right, we got a bathroom in here. This is nice. We got our own. We got our own bathroom for ourselves. Okay, I'll probably turn that water off. We are in a drought. Uh, we got some 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 bottles in here. Okay, a fuse box of absolutely. So the lights are going to go off at some point or another. Really, really, we really put a painting of a woman with blacked out eyes on the wall under a cross. Okay, yeah, of course, of course, this place is haunted. All right, let's uh grab that pencil. Let's do some signing here. I uh, use it to sign paperwork left on the door. Okay, quick inventory. Access quick inventory and choose the item you wish to use. Most, but not all places where the item can be used will cause the item icon to appear. Uh, after selecting an item, its description will appear below it. If an item uh, can be dropped, the drop button will appear under the item description. Got it. No, no. Can we put that? Can we put it in our hands? I want the pencil in the hands. No. All right. Uh, do we left click? Ah, we left click. Rebecca, I I did I signed it. Oh wait, no, that that was that was what was written for me. Okay, I think I signed everything. So that's it. That's all we had to do. We can go home now. Cool. Thanks for having me. All right, can't leave. Do I go through this door? 
Uh, okay, the door goes through me. That's a body. Let's just open this for like, you know, possible exit later on. Yeah, we'll, we'll keep all these open. You never know when you need to get out. Ooh. Okay. You... Great, perfect. Hi. I just finished with Mr. Dull. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. Okay. Moving the deceased. Use the gurney by standing behind it and pressing the gurney interact key, then walk backwards with the gurney down the hall. Uh, boy, do I wish I could, you know, like, like push the gurney forward. What are you writing? You're really hammering that one spot, aren't you? Computer locked. Okay, so you're not doing anything. You're faking work. Meanwhile, here I am doing all the hard work, moving this old ass man. Let's go, mister, whatever your name was. Loki, you're in good shape for a dead person. Uh, to bring a body in or out of cool storage, open the bay with the body's name, pull out the rack, and then, ah, so, so I have to remember the name is what you're telling me. Good. What was this man's name? Oswald Dalton. That was an old name, man. Uh, so we got it. I don't know what LMB me. Oh, left. Oh, gotcha. I just, I just have to. I have to pull it out. Gotcha. All right. So and then we and then we put old man over here. All right. Come on, old man Jenkins. I can't really like. All right. So you just snap in there. Nice. All right. Bye, friends. Enjoy endless nothingness. Can you get all the way in there? Thank you. I appreciate that very much. Uh, we're going to move our gurney. Do I just have to move? I got, oh, I got I to gotta go. I'm sorry. I got to go get another person real quick. This is like shopping simulator, but super macabre. Oh, that's nice. We put a bra on her. Wait, uh, wait we got, we get to keep, she gets to keep her dignity. That's, that's good. Ma'am? 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 I'm not going to ask again. Do I have to move the gurney? Okay. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to move, we're going to move the gurney. We're going to move the gurney. We're going to pull this woman out. Why? No, that's in. Clearly you can move. Oh, you don't look. You have to walk. I'm dumb. All right. Got her on it. Let's get it. You're also not in bad shape for a dead person. Your eyes are super creepy though. Uh, I'm sorry. Can you, I, there's no way to turn this is the issue. Oh, there is. It's just very slow going. Gotcha. Oh, got an incinerator too. Nice. Uh, this whole going backwards thing is kind of a pain. Ma'am, could you cover up? This is a place of work. Business casual at least. Apparently you can't go backwards. Nice feet. Hey, yeah. For free? All right. I'm just finishing up something here. So why don't you grab the clipboard? You are on the same spot. I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. You're a liar. You've done nothing since I've been gone. Uh, large item. Okay, we we did it. We got that. We got the clipboard. View clipboard space. Dorothy Page, age 87. Damn. Record any distinguishing marks. Uh, enter markings into computer. Any distinguishing? Uh oh. You got a bump. Inspecting a body. Hover the cursor over unique markings such as moles, scratches, bruises to interact with them and record them to the clipboard. Gotcha. You got a bruise right there. Rotate. Okay, I can I can move her arm around. All right, that's that's all I needed to see there. Thank you. Uh oh, what is that? Is that an is that an infection? I don't know, but whatever it is, keep it away from me. These old windows never stay latched. So do the windows? Okay, but no, but the windows, the windows I opened over there were, were they're, they're fine. Is it her? I mean, her eyes are kind of gross. Does that count if her eyes are gross? I don't, I don't see anything. I think, I think her, I think her head's fine besides being gross. Yeah, I think she's good, man. I think, I think she's good. She's super dead. I think, I think that's, that's important that we point that out. Oh, never mind. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Okay, so that, is that you telling me that I'm done? Out to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. After that, we'll get started. Pretty handsome for a mortician. Riverfields Network, how to enter cadaver information. Click the record system icon to open the program. I didn't say anything. You all right? Y yeah, I'm fine. Sorry. I was, I was, I was reading. Match sections on your clipboard to the corresponding sections on the computer. Once all the findings have entered into the system, click submit to print out the embalming records and file the records up front to begin the embalming. Okay. Record system. Con contusion on the right arm. Keratolosis on the left leg and mild abrasion on the right leg. And that's, that's it. Okay. Submit. Oh. Do I have to write her name? Surely I don't have to write name. I gotta click it. Uh, an age 87. Got it. All right. Nailed it. And still super dead. Got it. Uh, embalming report. A uh, packet of mortuary paperwork related to the handling of the deceased. File up front so they're available if requested. Large item. I gotta follow these footmarks. Who put these footmarks here? That's the... I forgot I put an alert box on here. That's fine. I was, that, that might cause a jump scare later on. Time to embalm. 
Time to embalm indeed, baby. I'm gonna take this vase with me in case I need a weapon. Dorothy, you wanna hold this for me? Setting the face. Pull the manipulator up and press the injector button to the drive barbs into the skull, then twist the wires and shut. You can just go ahead and get started. That's dark. Everything's on your list there if you need it. What list? I'm missing something. I mean, I'm missing something. I need tools, gotcha. A moisturizing wipe, a wipe to moisturize the skin of the deceased. Okay. Setting needles, barbs with a length of wire, use the needle injector to wire the, the jaw shut. I'm gonna need that injector, needle injector, a tool used for hammering, setting needle barbs into the skull. Hammering, oh God. Scalpel, small, yeah, I know what a scalpel is. Uh, Eye caps, these are holding the eyelids shut. Yeah, her eyes are super creepy. Flexible, durable tubing used for various medical applications. No. Your hands are full, gotcha can't hold anything else okay then let's put that let's put that down and let's let's sew her mouth closed real quick what do i have to oh am i doing this right oh god i'm gonna be so i'm gonna be so haunted for doing this yeah i mean i am just hammering her mouth man hey yo what am i what do i gotta oh uh no, that's open is the problem. We gotta go, we gotta, I'm sorry. Yeah, we gotta go, we gotta go closed here. here we go. Yeah! Uh, can we go ahead and do, can we go ahead and do those eyes now? Eye caps. I can't use that here. What do you, what do you mean we can't use that here? Placing the eye caps. Use a manipulator to open the eyelid completely. Interact with the eye to place the cap to close the eye. Oh, that's awful. Nice and wide, Dorothy. Nice and wide. Now let's keep those eyes closed forever. Cool, let's turn on some tunes. That's clearly appropriate. I don't, I don't know what you want me to put in there. Do you want me to, do you, you want me to take the methanol? Chemical use the from, uh, use to hold formaldehyde in solution by preventing polymerization. Large item. Anything else? I don't know, man. I don't need my, I don't need my clipboard or my moisturizing. I don't, I don't want to drop these things. Can I just move them out of my hands? Can I moisturize her skin? Mix embalding fluid in pump. Is that, is this, is this the pump? Oh, that definitely is the pump. I can't hold anything. Put it in your pockets. I don't, I don't give a shit. Okay, okay you know what? Okay, fine. How do I, how do I drop the methanol? I'll pick you up in a second. Yo! Hmm, sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly and it can make them pop like that. That's just not true. Keep doing your thing. I'll get it. I'm so, did I pick up? I did, I picked it up, okay. All right, a chemical that uh, adds in retaining moisture, large item, gotcha. Uh, an arterial fluid base used for firming and preserving tissue. Large item. Uh, an arterial fluid base used for firming and preserving tissue. So same, same thing. Formaldehyde, baby. Let's get her. Let's get her pumped full of chemicals. Yeah, all, all shook up. Make an incision in the carotid artery and jugular vein with the scalpel. I know where that is. Oh God! Some items need to be used directly on the body. To use an item, open quick inventory and select the item needed. What do I have to use? Clipboard? I don't think that's it. I think I need to. I don't. I don't do any of the moisturizing wipe. Do I need to? Oh God! Uh, use for injecting cavity directly into or. Oh, okay. Should we, should we take that? Uh, okay, that's in our pocket. We'll, we'll keep our moisturizing wipe. Um, I don't know, what do I have to put in there? Use forceps to clamp tubing to both veins and connect to embalming pump. Okay, all right, well then we gotta drop. We gotta drop some things here. Uh, yeah, but moisturizing pad, I need forceps. Forceps, artery forceps. We could have cleaned these. That would have been a good idea. We're clamping an artery and then we'll grab all right now now we're now we're doing it man we're gonna bleed you like a pig dorothy this is very weird because my girlfriend's name is dorothy so this is a lot for me emotionally all right we got you all hooked up now engage the pump and let the body drain okay mm -hmm. oh that's that's lovely so happy i could help you uh really transition to the next world dorothy that is oh i feel like i'm doing a good thing here all right body's draining you're just staring a hole in the back of my head how much blood do you have just a... hello i need my fucking i need my vase i need my vase who was that oh good it was nobody we don't have to worry about it don't worry i checked it out i was i was i was equipped sufficiently all right, we'll leave that vase right there just in case. All right, so I think Dorothy's done draining. Uh, turn up the pump, remove tubes, and close incision. All right, so let's start there. Let's get you stitched up here. You're all, you're, you've been you've been bled like a pig. Ah, oh, look at that. I, apparently, I'm I'm so good at stitching. I didn't even need sewing needles. 
Fill an empty IV res res reservoir bag uh, with cavity fluid, then insert trocar into abdominal cavity. Flex bag, top fill container, uh, IV reservoir bag, and IV bag used for infusing bombing fluids into organs and cavities. Where do I get this? Where do, where do, I, where do I get the liquid? Ah, there's the cavity fluid in a Gatorade cooler. Great. Is it full now? I'm assuming it's full. Okay. Filling body cavities. Insert the trocar until it stops to begin the flow of or of, of embalming fluids. Once the cavity is full, pull the trocar back, rotate it, and reinsert the reservoir bag is empty. Ah, yeah, let's get you in there. I don't even really know what I... Oh, I gotta move it. Yeah, I gotta make sure that she's all just stuffed full of chemicals. Great abs for an 87 year old. Really genuinely impressive. Uh, can't even, can't even hate Dorothy. Is that gonna be it? There you go, Dorothy. That you're welcome. Apparently I gotta walk over to here now. I don't know, what do I need to do? Mix cleaners in bathroom closet to create tank cleaner and then pour into the embalming pump. I feel like this could have been closer, but okay. Flow clean, a solution of corrosive inhibitors, a descaler to create the mixture needed clean and bombing got got it so i did it my chemicals are mixed i mixed ammonia and bleach uh let's clean let's clean you all right nice and nice and clean do i need you need to be moisturized now dorothy do i need to moisturize the body i do let's get you nice and moisturized dorothy you look a bit crusty it's taking sweet time bro let's keep that open yeah lotioning move the wipe across the facial features while holding down interaction button uh until the lotion is moved up yeah, let's get you nice and lubed up. Oh yeah, you look, oh, okay. I don't think the moisturizer worked. What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from here. Oh, okay. Are you sure? I just got here. Don't worry, you're doing great. Thanks. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today. Okay, bye. I'm, yeah, I'm good, I'm good to go. Yeah, thank you. All right, we beat the game, we did it. Good job, everybody. Um, thanks for checking in for today's video on NC Gamer 23. Uh, if you guys enjoyed what you saw, uh, type it out in the comments and never mind. Oh, weird. Still go. So some stuff fell over. That's not a big deal. No, I know. It, it wasn't even my fault, but he sent me home right after that. I'm just really worried. He's complicit. Wow, our apartment is sad. So that's a good thing. Yeah, it just didn't feel like he meant it. Like... He just said it to get me out of the building. Uh, wait a sec, I have- Got another call. Hello? I was pouring out. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just- No, no. Uh, he wants to come back in. Apologize. You've done a fantastic job. Just not feeling too well. That's uh, actually why I'm calling. I know it's late, but we just got three new cadavers, and no one else can make it in right now. Oh! Don't go in. No, don't, don't. Well, uh, yeah. Nope. Sure? You don't need to impress this boss. Excellent. You're doing me a huge favor. He's literally dying from haunting. I took care of the rest of your onboarding. We're all set. And your new badge is in your personal belongings drawer in the back room. That's great. Uh, thank you. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. We're gonna die. Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. We switched light. We switched calls that quick. Congratulations. Thanks. I have to go like right now. I'll talk to Why you. Why are you so excited? Who's excited to go into work late at night to embalm dead bodies? Oh God, I think I'm the problem. Michael Jackson slide on him one time. Uh, should we like inspect our house first? Death and Decay, a book covering the process of the science of decomposition. Oh God, okay. Where that girl? That's not creepy. It's pouring out. It's the middle of the night. Our boss isn't feeling good. Um, wait, hold up. That's that's got the symbol. The nicest people are dead. This is this is this is all this is all very dark. Music band shirt. I also am a big fan of the music band. Also of the team sports. Yeah, big big fan of them as well. What's this? What are these trinkets? Hey, uh, my dad's necklace. Oh, we're bringing. The one song radio station. Song, it's all we have the budget for. <laughs> I'm DJ Two Shades. 
<laughs> DJ Touche is just the one song radio station. That's so funny. 10 year coin, my sobriety coin. Five year coin, my dad's sobriety coin. Is that just, that's gonna fill out my pockets though, is the issue, man. I mean, I feel like I should have those things for like plot reasons, but like, I feel like that's a lot of my, a lot of my pockets. You know what? I can, I can just, I can just drop them if I don't, if I don't need them. Donut stuff. Yeah, let's ruin this apartment. We're probably not gonna make it back here, so no need to. I need to really worry about this. God, we are living sad. All right, I guess let's get out. Let's get out. We've seen everything we need to see. Where are my keys? God, I close those. Oh, I don't know where your keys are. I I got I got thrown into this cut scene. Okay, there it is. Keys to the apartment, car, and front door of Riverfields. Good. Temporary items. Keys. Uh, do not take up space in your normal inventory. Use a temporary item by directly interacting with objects that requires it. Got it. Embalm. Book about the history of preservation. The you people use a couple of depth. That's our mother. Oh, no, never mind. That's grandma. Okay. Uh, that, she looks pretty good to be our grandmother. Oh, God. What if we have to embalm our grandmother? Oh, <gasps> that'd be fucked up. Uh, okay. There was, apparently, there's no driving bit. We're just at River Fields. Got it. Let's close, let's close that. It's nice and dark here. Let's maybe... This is, this is the back door. Wow, you can really run around outside here. I figured this. I figured you wouldn't be able to do this. This is nice. Nice and locked. Okay, that's where we need to be. Let's grab, let's grab this lock. Oh, that lock is that lock is being used to lock something currently. It is too bright in this room for me to play this very, very dark game. I can't see anything. All right, let's get in there. We know the layout of the place now. The vase is back. So head to the back and get started. Cool, man. Uh, why are you freaking out? You freak out, it freaks me out. Oh, hello? I remember. Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. What? Try to stay calm. Oh. I'll unlock the door in a moment. Oh, that's him. This is very sudden, but listen to me. We have to start right away. I'm sorry. I didn't know until it made itself known this morning. What do you mean? Let alone bound to you. I had no way of knowing the possession had started. What? What? Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. We can go through a window. Act quickly. This is insane. I'll just leave. I'll, I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I can't allow that for you or for others. Oh, he's gonna keep me in there. Dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay calm. Uh-huh. Okay. We embalm, file the paperwork, everything. Yeah. Read it like a normal day. Stay it's not far from a normal day. I left some things for you on the desk. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. Why? No. Why? <sighs> Damn it, what the fuck? Why would you? This is insane. Why, why lock me in? Oh God, okay, all right. Stupid. Just some hazing for the new girl or something. Just. Old key, hall key, tape recorder. I got none of those. Okay, so I have the, I have the old key and the hall key. Oh, and then the tape recorder. How do I use the tape? I guess there's no tape in there. Is there a gun in any of these? So no gun is what you're telling me. What kind of desk doesn't have a gun? That's locked, so we gotta use the hall key. Open that bad boy up. What was this? What is that? A box of matches? Matchbox, one left. Okay, we're probably gonna need that. I'm assuming we're gonna need to blow something up or light something on fire, so kinda nailed that. Hey, what's good? It's me, it's your boy, Skinny Penis. Hello, cleaner base. I probably don't need this right now. So let's just go ahead and drop that. Let's get our trusty vase. Come here, and... I'm fucking quitting tomorrow. I mean, who does something like this? That's a great question. Who does something like this? And I'm being called again. Do we need two phones this close to each other? All right, listen carefully. I'm, look, I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me, but I hope you do before it's too late. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. Banish the demon? You will need to learn the demon's name. What? Find it to its chosen body. What? Burn it in the retort. Uh, Why is he talking like this? Something he's done before. I wish I could do more for you. I had years to learn what I know. You have hours. That's insane. What? I won't be calling again. You can't trust the. How did he even know I'm in here? Listen to the tapes. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. Can I burn all three? What's why don't I burn everybody? I feel like I should burn everybody. Uh, my new work badge, lovely. Oh, that's good. I am quitting tomorrow, so it's not really a thing I need. Uh, 10 year sobriety coin, 
dad's sobriety coin dad's necklace okay so if i had it didn't matter that i picked him up before i would have gotten him now anyways tissue builder help for storing more okay i don't this is this okay so let's just grab a body and get to work here let's grab a body and get to work here i guess man we got we got we got to find the demon learn its name and burn i don't know why we can't let those Criminal uh, building. that's awesome that's just so good that's so good that the lights don't work so do we even know i don't even think we know what bodies am i supposed to be evolving nobody told me probably nathan kelly hi nathan hi nathan you're not okay you are wearing clothes that's good that's good nathan that's a step in the right direction i'm not fighting a naked ghost okay apparently i don't get to hold nathan anymore Can I, i'm trying to use the gurney here i'm clicking e thank you all right nathan let's get you all cut up are you smiling at me you you, you could stop that uh, you, you, you can stop that. I wouldn't mind that. All right, let's check you out. Yeah, Nathan, let's, let's, let's check you out, buddy. Let's, let's give you the, the, the big, the big pat down here, the ocular pat down. Why can I not look at you? Do I need to grab the clipboard first? I think I probably need to grab the clipboard first. All right. At least I can keep track of things. Yeah, so let's, now let's rotate. Oh, I can, I can rotate his whole, his whole thing. Yeah, we're gonna, got some claw marks on him. I don't know why everybody's got claw marks all of a sudden. Uh, nothing else. You're all good. Some better lighting would probably be more conducive to finding things. I mean, literally, what? Hello? Oh! No, Nathan! Nathan! Nice. Well, we could just break it. Like, we could just... It's, it's, it's an old window. All right, Nathan. Um, I, I do need to look at your head still, Nathan. So if you could go ahead... You go ahead and just... And just, yeah, chill out for a second. I think that's what I just clicked. All right. Good. Good, 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 good. All right, Nathan. So... Just stay there. You're getting re you're doing really good, Nathan. You're just you're you're my you're 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 your mommy's your mommy's little little hero right now. I'm, I wish I hadn't said that. I think that's oh nope, Nathan. You're you're just you're just covered with issues, aren't you? I think that's everything for Nathan. Oh nope, and then a bullet wound, maybe? I don't I don't know, Nathan. What's 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 going on with you, big guy? Wow, I really hope the demon doesn't take your body. I I do not I do not think I could take you in a fight. 38 years old. Yeah, I'm definitely not taking you in a fight. Uh, we got a couple things we gotta pick up here. Mini cassette tape labeled the process of possession. Every moment the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you until you are unable to resist. Oh identifying a demonic entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known. Uh-huh. you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. Mm -hmm. The only way I've found to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just scribble. Okay. Look carefully. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. Okay, well, there's been some strangings. And a pencil on the desk in the front room. Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. Okay. Uh, where's the, where's the, where's the pen and pencil? I can sprint. Okay, good. There's a pen. Pen and pencil. Can be used to check how far one slipped into possession. Should we? So that's, that's how far we're into possession is one scribble? Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Um, I don't know. All right. Um, uh, yep. Night shift system. The night shift database. A computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. Database contains all the information on the process of exposure. Okay. Tools used. And most importantly, all the markings. What's the night shift code? If you ever forget what to do, replay these tapes or look it up in the database. Just tell me the code. The collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece to the puzzle. I need the code. You will need this information. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passcode to access it. Okay. Use it. In your personal belongings drawer? I, like, I, like, I know where your personal belongings drawer is. I don't even know. It's my first day. Is this, is this the personal belongings door? Type of typhoon co conversion. Six typhoon walked among his disciples and he spoke. He doesn't, does not truly let the Lord into his heart shall be judged by his sin and destined to serve those who truly believe for all are assigned to the halls of hell. Seven abandoned gods as he, is this the code? Is it six, seven, eight, nine, ten? I don't, a bunch of typhoon let the charge remains of Derod. I should probably read this right. Abandon God as he's abandoned you. Bring Lucifer into your hearts and yeah. Uh, and revel in his glorious sin for all are damned. There is no hope of God. All are marked for those houses of hell as are hopelessly lost. You have been left behind. It's fucking, 
so metal as he passed uh one ran looked upon typhoon with disgust and said i will not turn my eye from god satan has no dominion over the lord's creation typhoon looked on to onarian and said pray as you wish fall to your knees at this moment and call to god perhaps today he shall step down from the heavens and doubt uh shall vanish pray to nothing and behold the truth I will take uh, from your God's creation the ashes of man and burn it eternal and sinful fire. Typhon held the charred remains of Dirod and walked among his disciples, spreading his ash upon their flesh, setting the reeds into his hands ablaze. He said unto, un uh, and I, I'm struggling with that one. See now that they're all marked in the glory of Satan. Isn't that kind of like, like putting ashes on your forehead, like Ash Wednesday, whatever. Uh, one ran beheld a flash of light upon the skin unto each of his disciples as Typhon passed uh, from it. He saw a mark burned deep into their flesh, one of three for the houses of hell. Uh, for we're all destined to serve uh, his higher purpose. And Typhon extended to the ashes of Dayrod to the hands of Owner and it said, bear the forgotten flesh upon your own, ignite this sin and accept the true God. Lots to unpack there. Where's the ID card? Where, I don't even know where, where's the, where's the personal belongings or whatever. To banish a demon to hell. Yep. It must be bound to its chosen body. This goddamn ID. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration uh -huh. spell the demon's name. I do not know that alphabet. The bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the mark. Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. Okay. When the mark is placed on the correct body with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to it. What? Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain, oh, I'm not going to do good. Burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must inscribe the sigils of its name in our world to begin the evocation. What? You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. Huh? Hold a letting strip up while wandering the mortuary. If it begins to smolder and burn, you're close. When the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. What? They can be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture. Huh? Anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them. So check regularly. What? Once you uncover the sigils, use the night shift database to decide oh, which demon you're dealing with. And use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are simple. No, they're not. The reagent to the embalming mixture. Uh-huh. Uncover the sigils. Okay. Build the mark and place it on the body. Okay. Then, when you're certain, Okay, that's not that simple. Use letting strip. Okay. Any any sigils around here? I still haven't found the ID. Oh, that's bad. That's that's bad. Uh, oh, okay. So it's around here then, yeah? So it's around here? Ah, okay. Well, it's around here then i don't know i don't i don't see a sigil anywhere is it in your back nope okay um uh i don't i don't it was it was right here man okay that's cavity fluid i don't see a sigil anywhere i'm not super observant oh i'm dumb okay so that's that's one of them that's that's it that's one of the that's one of the sigils right that's got to be so that's that's a that's a that's a the circled moon type thing. Uh, uh, which one is that? That's that one. So we're gonna yeah, and we're gonna put you there. Nice, dude. We're we're getting it now, baby. We're getting it now. Okay, so we should should we are we are we are we worried about embalming any of these bodies? Actually, like, do I have to do all the things I did for Dorothy there, or 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 are we just are we just gonna do I? Homie, I can leave. We can go. Why are we here? Okay, whatever. Let's see if there's any sigils down the hallway. Any sigils in here? No, no sigils. Like lit, bro, I'm out. Are you kidding me? No, I'm gone. Pause, don't say I can actually leave. Nah, I gotta deal with, I gotta deal with this demon, bro. I gotta deal with the demon. I gotta deal with the demon, but I can leave. I, mm, I feel like I'm doing, I feel like I'm doing the classic white person thing right now. Yo, wait, what if the sigils are outside? What if that's why they're letting me outside? Nah, the demon wouldn't put his sigils outside, would he? How would this, how would this piece of paper light on fire with all this rain? At least we can run from the demon, sort of. That's nice, right? Well, no, no, no sigils. So all good in that regard. I guess we're just gonna keep these windows open and let's get back to your body here, bud. Let's go ahead and get you nice and embalmed. I mean, that is what we're here to do at the end of the day. So record system, let's go contusion on the head. 
Right shoulder, mild abrasion, left shoulder, a mole. I don't know why we have to mark down a mole. Blemishes on the right arm, keratosis on the left arm, uh, keratosis on the right leg, and nothing on the left leg. And we're going to go ahead and say your name is Nathan Kelly and your age is 38. Man, how did you die at 38? What a loser, right? No, I'm kidding. You can die whenever. I don't know. I don't, what am I afraid of offending dead people? All right, what do I got to do next? Is that, is that literally it? I need to file the copy of it. Ah, file the copy up front. Thank God for, for her saying things out loud. Oh, the copy. The printed copy. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I'll take this. Let's go over here. Okay, let's get that copy up in there. Uh, embalming report. Bingo, bango, bongo. Nathan, we're gonna get you nice and cut open today. All right, how you feeling? You feeling good? Yeah, I know. Nobody likes coming to the dentist, but here we are. Wire jaw shuts with needle injector. Uh, needle injector. Where are you? Where, where, where are my tools, man? Let's take a scalpel just for, for later in case we need defense. Forceps for later in case we need defense. E eye caps. Yeah, we'll take those as well. We need, ah, there's my needle injector. Pockets are full. What do you mean your pockets are full? I only picked up, ah, like, like legitimately full. What do we drop, man? What do we drop? Do we drop our sobriety coin? We can leave our sobriety coins on the desk. You know what? We'll leave our sobriety coins right here. Cannot be dropped. Mmm, item can't be dropped. Awesome, man. I guess we're just, we'll just leave our, we'll leave the matchboxes there. Nice. So remember that. I'm for sure. Can you chill? We'll remember, we'll remember in the future to, to make sure we, we pick up those matches should we need matches. I'm missing something. What do you mean we're missing something? What do we, we just need, we need the, we need the, we need the, oh, and setting needles is what we need. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So I'm gonna have to drop another thing. Where am I setting? Yeah, there, the, the, there's setting needles. All right, got it. All right, let's get your mouth closed because you're creepy. Nobody likes creepy. Yeah, let's just get you nice and wired shut there. Just real, yep, stop uh, being creepy. Much better, much, much better. Now let's get those, let's get those eye caps in there. Let's get these. All right, listen, I understand nobody likes their eyes closed forever, but you're gonna have to deal with it, all right? All right, enough of the attitude, Nathan. Mix embalming fluid. How are my, how are the pockets doing? All right. That's me. Okay. Should I go say hi? Hi, me. Mmm. Okay. Let's. Well, I don't. I don't much believe in religion, but okay. Well, I could, I could, I, we could have a cross. I should probably have a letting. I should probably go get a letting strip. Okay. Is there gonna be a sigil? Do you want a hug or? Okay. So you didn't want a hug, is what you're trying to tell me. Okay, so I'm assuming we're pretty far along in this whole, uh, that's how far along we are, apparently, in the whole demonic, the whole demonic thing. All right, that was, that was fun. That was cool to see myself being hung. That's, that's unreal. That's super, super not scarring emotionally for me or anything. All right, Nathan, uh, we're gonna pretend like nothing just happened and I'm gonna continue back to your, back to mixing your embalming fluid, which I am gonna have to, we're gonna, we gotta, which one of these do we need? Bleach, bleaching agent. I don't know why I would need bleach. Where is all the embalming fluid? I think it's, yeah, it's here. All right, we're gonna methanol. Let's get that shooken up in there. Did I need it? Yeah, this one. Formaldehyde. Yep, we're just gonna get you so embalmed, good buddy. What else did I need? Glutarolabalhyde. I literally used to be a chemist. Bro, my hands are sweating. I don't, I don't know where in this gluta, gluta whatever is. Honestly, I don't, I don't know where I would even begin to find that. Why are we hiding the reagents I need? What, that, that doesn't seem like, doesn't seem like, like best, like our best practice. Why is it here? Every cabinet stays open. I am a man. All right, let's go grab this, this holy water. Baleful reagent, a bottle of unknown liquid used to identify demonic tenancy. Great. I'm not getting paid enough. Yeah, buddy. So we're gonna need the scalpel and the clamps. Yeah, we're gonna go, we're gonna get those artery forceps. We're gonna get you nice and sliced up there. We're gonna. Do you mind? Let's get you nice and artery forceped up. Oh, nope, I need tubing. That tubing? That's tubing, gotcha. Things are fine. We're just we're just helping the dead, man. That's really that's really what it comes down to here is we're just we're out here helping the dead. Let's Yep, Nathan, let's get you nice and bled there. Meanwhile, while you bleed, uh we're going to we're going to go on a little little ex little expedition here. 
Got it. Oh, uh, yeah, it's a upside down. I'm pretty sure that's a musical note. So you keep on bleeding, Nathan. I got to find the name of a demon. And uh, listen, he might even he might even get to go in your body. Isn't that that's fun, right? It's fun and interesting. Uh, back. Why does that? That's the Iron Cross. So don't don't know how to don't know how to unpack that. Let's get you stitched up, buddy. All, all good. What's next? We have to, I'm pretty sure we need empty. Yep, we need a reservoir bag, which could be found. I liked when everything was nice and laid out for me. That was, that was fun. Oh, yeah, okay, there they are. Now we need to open it with the cavity fluid. Now we got to get our little big old, big old, imagine a needle this size being stabbed into you. Yeah, let's, yeah, uh-huh. You're welcome, Nathan. Yep, we're just, we're filling that belly up. Oh. Alrighty, you're all done, Nathan. Yeah, that's, that's great. You're all in bombed. Uh, mix cleaners in the bath. Oh, I forgot about this. I forgot about this. We should probably take a letting strip with us, just in case. You know, there's another sigil. Uh, feel like feel like that's kind of us assuming that like that that we we. Mmm. Okay. All right. Do I walk that way? Hello. Okay. <laughs> gonna move we're gonna move i hate this all right all right all right all right are your eyes open yet they're not they're not all right the car is still right there and we'll grab we'll grab this so we gotta we gotta mix it with that <laughs> We're ready to clean, baby. We are ready to clean. Should we really have to clean this every time we use it? I mean, do these bodies really care if they get like used formaldehyde? Like that's that. that I, don't, I don't know. It just feels feels a bit unnecessary, if you ask me. All right, we got that. We got that cleaning. Applied moisturizer to the facial features. It's so nice that even as we're being haunted by a demonic spirit, that we're truly worried about how these dead people's faces look moisturized. Put that away and let's get you moisturized up here, bud. Ah, we're doing, we're really doing the Lord's work here, aren't we? Wow, you look wet. All right, let's, let's, let's get you back, Nathan. This is clearly what's the most important thing is actually doing our job. How do you go in again? Was it like this? Was it, was it like this? It was like that. All right, let's get you. Yeah, bye, Nathan. Okay. Uh, Christine, you're next. Holy, never mind. Don't, nope, that's it. You could not do that. That would be nice for me emotionally. Hey, enough, right? Enough, grow up. All right, ghost, get out, get, get, skedaddle. Listen, I'm gonna say it. Christine had some cannons while she was alive. All right, all right, I'm sorry. It's not that I find her attractive now. She's dead, but bazinga. All right, Christine. A lot of young dead people today. I wonder what that's about. The other people I, I unboxed were, uh, we're uh, a lot younger. All right, Christine, let's get you. Let's get you looked over here. You got anything on your back, Christine? You do have something on your back. No idea what it is. Uh, you already got. Okay, that's why you already got an incision there. Gotcha. Oh boy, your eyes are just. You're just so dead. You're really just, just so, so dead. Wait, this shouldn't be like honestly. If I'm being entirely real, if I could get, if I could get, if I could get too real, uh, right now, this just shouldn't be. This job shouldn't exist. Just fucking, when I die, just throw me in the ground. Just throw, don't embalm me. I don't, I don't need to be present at my funeral. That's what's weird about all of this. Why do we need to be present at our funerals? Like, I just don't, you don't need to look at my body. That's weird, man. Don't stump me full of chemicals. Just literally, the second I die, dig a hole, throw me in there. GG's, see you later. All right, we gotta, we gotta put, I never found that ID card, man. I, that's not what I was trying to do. Where are his personal belongings? Where are his personal belong? I just, bro, I feel like I'm losing my mind here. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm legitimately losing my mind. I don't know where his personal belongings would be. It's like in my personal belongings drawer and find my ID card, which has the night shift and keep that open. Uh, that has the night shift code thing. Can we? Oh my God, we can control the lights? I'm turning the lights back on in the hallway, bro. This is creepy as hell in here. Thank you. Oh, 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 oh. I don't know why I pulled on my clipboard. Okay, I think, uh, I think, I think we're making a little progress on the, uh, where are this man's personal belongings? Cause without him, without, without finding these personal belongings, I'm just straight up not getting into night shift. Oh, why would he have it there? That's a terrible smile. Uh, the code is 3487. 
Three, four, eight, seven. Remember that for me, please. I was born in 1944. This man saw World War II. Raymond, I really need a key to the hatch outside. Cleaner is low, and you mentioned having some down there before. I know you don't trust anyone to go down there, but having a copy of the key would be make things a lot easier for me. Zoe, extra keys. Mr. Delver's extra keys to the mortuary. Okay, okay, okay. So that's that'll be that'll be good. Can I take that? I can't. I can't take those. That's my. That's yep. That's my card. Okay. It's just garbage. Hey, large old key. Not sure what this belongs to. We're gonna go find out. You think we're not gonna go find out right now? Can you wait? I mean, like, yeah, you're good there. You better believe we're gonna go find out what this large old key is to. Let's see if there's any sigils out here while we're out here. I bet you it's to the hatch, baby. We're gonna go get haunted even harder than we currently are. That's not it. Sad. Well, never mind. I probably could have guessed that if we're being entirely real. Probably could have guessed that it was like the, the, the hatch wasn't, you know, belonging to the large old key. No more sigils. No more sit. No, no more, no more sigils. No more sigils. Okay. All right. Let's get to, uh, we're not done. We, yeah, we got to, we got to put all your bruises in the system. Uh, right shoulder. Wait, no, this is Nathan Kelly. Okay. Right shoulder, left shoulder, right leg, left leg, left arm nailed it 21 my god must have been a wild night tonight man i feel like i missed the party nailed it all right hi christine you're good over there yeah she's, she's chilling i i guess let's log into night shift here just in case three four eight seven enter uh all right path to banishment and bomb each body with a special reagent use lighting strips in the cabinet to attempt to reveal demonic sigils uh, compare the found demonic sigils the demon's base name with a night shift database pay attention to each body for demonic activity build the mark to match the demon's name note that bringing an already in bomb's body back out to reinspect uh for changes may be necessary okay that's fine uh place the mark on the body believe that demonic tendency burn that body uh in retort before possession takes hold cool identifying demonic tendency while learning the name of demonic entity may be more about waiting identifying the body which is experiencing demonic tendency requires paying close attention while any bodies uh can be manipulated it's far easier for the entity to control its own vessel sudden movements large or small may be a sign of tendency okay if a body appears to be more active than others or strange markings uh start to appear maybe signs of demonic tendency however the demon is trying to its best to remain elusive and may manifest these manipulations of other bodies which is why it's important to take uh, note of which body is experiencing these events the more events linked to a specific body the more likely it is to be the chosen vessel the appearance of a new marking on the body sudden movements large or small repeat movements uh is one body more active than the others when a demonic entity is present the vessel it is occupying may four markings not previously observed inspecting but okay it's fine a body with demonic inhabitants is this a video all right this Yes. Um. This is David. Yeah. Raymond, this feels insane, but I think you were right. This has happened a few times now, but let me see if I can get in here. Oh, give me that toe shot for free! Ah, there it is. So that's what that's what I'm looking for. That's what. Oh, hold up. Nope. I want. I wanted to go. I wanted to go back. Okay. Wait, I'm on. Okay. So we got it. What about what about a uh, collection of demonic history? I feel like we probably don't need to worry about this right now. Uh, since I first experienced contact with demonic entities, I've dedicated myself to research everything I can do to prevent the attempts at possession. My journey has taken me all over the world in search of answers. I found that no particular religion has a full understanding of demonic while bits and pieces. Recovered language, quarter letting, the halls of hell. None of this is integral to banishment, but knowledge may still be of use. I'm more worried about, I'm more worried about this. I'm more worried about getting the sigils correctly. Each of the covetous demons belongs to one of the three houses, services in the halls of Satan, the houses of sin, desolation, emulation, invidious. Balmet, Anak, Telduk, Sebos. So these are just a bunch of demon names. Let's see. So far, let's so far I have so far I have this one, right? And then I have this one, if I'm not mistaken. So we can probably actually start to we can actually start to like like whittle some some down here. We have this one and this one. It's probably Uzkaret. I I can't I I yeah, it's almost definitely Uzkaret. Because I have this and this. That is the only one with those two, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, that's got that. That's got that. Okay, so it's Uzkaret. All right, bet. So we know our demon's name. That's huge. Uzkaret. Cool, man. Uh, what was I doing? I was taking this copy to the front. Yeah. Get it. Why are the lights off again? Stop turning the lights off, demons. Uzkaret, wherever it is you are. Very rude. Uh, we got to put that there. All good. No more sigils. I don't really even need the sigils to manifest. Like, I already know who the demon is. What do I still need to do here? Wire jaw. Gotcha. So let's go ahead and grab that bad boy. Some of these bad boys. Let's get that creepy mouth shut. That's just so much thunder, man. 
I feel like she's taking more than it usually takes. Really had to hammer her clothes, didn't we? Much better. Much better. Look, look how much less creepy you are now. Eye caps. Where did I put my eye caps? Have you seen my eye caps? I don't. Were they? Oh, they were in here. I'm dumb. Yeah. Bottom floor. Got it. No, look, can, give me the eye caps. Thank you. Christine, we're going to go ahead and make sure that your eyes never stay oh, yeah, yeah. open. Open wide. Your eyes are just so dead, man. So dead. All right. Next is, I believe, cutting you open. Ah, mixing embalming fluid. No. It's this. Yeah. Maldehyde. Man, having all these have all these cupboards open. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think we're I think we're a bit further in our demonic possession than we Oh! <laughs> Okay, so the demons can get you. That's a, that's a, that's a new, that's a new one. Should I stay away from that door? You know what? We'll just, we'll stay away from that door. Apparently the demons can get you. We know that now. I thought, I thought I could scare the demons away. Uh, I might need to, I kind of need to go back that way is the, uh, is the issue. Are you going to be chill? uh i don't know that was see because the problem was that wasn't chill that was that was anything but chill actually uh so we're gonna hmm. you know what yeah just you be in there i'll be in here it's called co-inhabiting spaces i think we we really i think we can really do it together uh i believe in us okay let me just if you don't mind, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get Christine nice and pumped up here. We're gonna get rid of all of her blood. No? Okay. Uh boy, is it so dark in here. Oh my goodness. Alright, I should probably remember where that is for future reference. Uh next thing we're gonna have to do is mixing cleaning fluid. So who's correct? If you could leave us alone, that would be <laughs> just so super dope, dude. I can't use that here. What do you you can't use that here is it is it because i'm doing it too early turn off pump remove yeah, 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 yeah okay i can't get i can't i can't be proactive i can't try and get ahead of my work here i'm gonna use my downtime here man okay fine we gotta we gotta we gotta empty our we gotta empty we gotta okay so i'm gonna have to drop this cleaner base real quick you stay there okay i gotta grab an iv bag cavity fluid okay let's get you let's get you nice you know what christine i'm gonna say the other guy, he stood up, he, he sat up, he was he was kind of a bully, you know, he was kind of mean. You, on the other hand, you have been just a treat, just a genuine treat. You, you haven't sat up, you haven't, you know, you've just, I mean, sure, I got eaten while dealing with you. Uh, that wasn't fun. That could, that could stop. Hmm, Randy, really? Now? Now's the time? Uh, hello? I, I need to report a missing person. Uh, Why are you calling me? Uh, her name's Rebecca Owens. She's 14. She, she has a drug problem. So I, have that race, so we should... uh, I, I, I don't know. Why are you calling me? At the house. I understand that. I need you to check them. What? All right. What's going on? All right. Uh, I'll keep an eye out. Thank you. I don't think I said anything. Demonic possession still about the same, so that's good. Mix cleaners in the bathroom closet. Okay, let's 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 go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Mix some cleaners. Ukarat. Oh. Oh. Well, that's not what you want your floor to be made out of. Hello. I need to report a missing person. Am I the missing person? She. She, she has a drug. What's going on? Oh, this is lovely. Rebecca. 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 Oh, this is when I was 14. Maybe no. Oh, 
Did you just sneeze yourself to- <laughs> Was that my fucking dad? Oh my god, get smoked, nerd. <laughs> okay, uh, now that we've unpacked that childhood trauma, I guess let's, let's make some cleaner, baby. Nothing makes me want to clean an embalming pump like watching my father die. All right. By the way, any, uh, any sigils? Any, any sigils? Sigils. Got any sigils? No? Okay. Got any fathers? Me either. Did your hands change? I feel like your hands changed. All right. Well, <laughs> let's get, uh, let's get to cleaning this bump. Yeah. Yeah. That's the only thing I'm worried about right now. What's next? Apply moisturizer. I am, while that's cleaning, I'm going to finish up, uh, Uzkaret's little, little bad thing here. So we need a Rasengan and a Kanji symbol. So let's go ahead and get a Rasengan. Where's that Rasengan at? Rasengan goes next to that. And the kanji goes, where's the kanji? Kanji goes there. We got our mark. All right. All we got to do is we can place, after we moisturize her, we can place the mark on her and we see if it, see if it gets real mad or not. That'd be truly devastating, man. Ah, ah, ha, ha, ha. Gotcha. I have, I'm too busy. I'm too busy having my mark here. Can I put the mark back in here? I would, I'd rather, I'd rather not, um, mess with it. Like this is technically the confirmation, but it's not in like the correct. I don't, I think, I think it should be okay. I think it's, I think, I think it should be fine. Oh, I'll put it back. Yeah, it's in there. Okay, cool. Uh, let's get you nice and moisturized, girl. You're gonna be ready for prom night when I'm done with you. Scrub-a-dub-dub, -dub, moisturizing up. Look at you. You look as good as the day you died. All done. We are gonna place this mark on you just to see if you're a demon. It's completely protocol, okay? So don't worry, we're not, it's not, it's not that we're, no, no, not what I'm trying to do. Not what I'm trying to do. How do we? Are you sure this is the right one? Oh, uh-huh. Uh no, I'm not. I don't, I don't think it is. I just wanted to see if placing that, placing that. Mmm. Ha! Ha! Ah! Ah! Okay. Um. Sigils? Uh, yes. Is that gonna be? Was that 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 was a that was a middle-aged white man? I'm assuming the next person we're gonna have to embalm is gonna be a middle-aged white man. So let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and take. Ooh, so the mark just doesn't move, and it just it just rotates through your chest. I feel like that's not what we need. All right, can I? Uh, there we go. I'm gonna take that back. Uh, cannot be dropped. Uh, but maybe return to the wardrobe. Okay. So I don't think, I don't think that was the one because I don't, uh, we don't, we, I don't, I don't, I didn't get a whole lot of, I mean, it was, she didn't, she didn't seem to love that, uh, but she also didn't do anything like demonic while, you know, we were, uh, while we were doing our thing there. So I think, I think, I think Christine's in the clear. I think, I think, I think Randy honestly was worse. So we're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna clear Christine. Christine, uh oh. Uh-huh. Seems as though we got another sigil in here, which is gonna basically confirm for us whether or not we are dealing with Uzkaret. Uh, which I'm like 99% certain we are, but we will see, won't we? All right, Christine, let's get you home, yeah? You've had a long day. All right, Christine, yeah, yeah. Let's get, let's actually, let's actually get an eye on Randy just while we're here to see if he has any additional marks. Who's correct? Where exactly did you put your third sigil here? Asking for a friend. Is that a trash bag? Those are trash bags, okay. So it blew up right about, ah, yes. Okay, so that's the kanji mark. So it's absolutely who's correct, yeah. So we're good on that. Oh, Nathan, I don't know why I thought your name was Randy, bud. Any fresh marks? You know what? We'll bring you back out once we're done embalming the third person. You're our number one suspect for the moment. Let's go ahead and make sure everybody gets their day job. Ah, middle-aged white man, okay. Of course, man. That's what people don't realize. Culprit's usually a white man. Getting a little bit of, you know, like light scattering here. So that's a thing. But it's definitely who's correct. We know that, at least. I don't like how all of you are smiling when I start wheeling you. I, I really understand the whole sewing the mouth closed thing now. All right, let's start your process here, friend. Why do you all have claw marks? You got a bruise on your foot. Can I rotate your feet? I can't. You got a mole. I really feel like moles don't need to be accounted for, but I mean, why? I'm not the mortician, so what do I know? But have you ever done an arms day in your entire life? There we go. That's it? Okay, when she says, when she says, there we go, I'm assuming. By the way, we check how we're doing. Ah, 
I don't know if that's better or worse. Okay, right shoulder. Oh, no. Right shoulder, mild abrasion. Right arm, whatever that is. Right leg, contusion. Left arm, blemishes. Left leg, mole. Your name is Justin Pollard, and you were 54 years old. GG's. Cool, man. It's still 12.15. Not a singular minute has passed since we got here, so that's cool. I mean, the workday, really just crawling. But on the plus side, apparently I'm very good at my job. I get it done very quickly. Justin, we're going to ignore the fact that you ran at me a second ago. Because uh, I don't want to talk about it. I'd rather I'd rather we don't. So you stay there. Uh, we are going to hammer your mouth closed. I mean, you really got to hammer it through these gums, man. Five wax on these things? It's crazy. There we are. All right. Now we need eye caps. Man, I'm actually getting pretty good at this whole embalming bodies thing. I would never want to do it in person, but... Who, oh, buddy, could I figure this out? Why are your eyes closed? Our first guy has had their eyes closed coming in here. Now we cut you open? Nah, now we gotta mix the embalming fluid. Oh! Wasn't a big fan of that. Yeah, you see... You see, that there feels like... Feels like main baddie energy. Mm. Hey, Chief, I'm gonna need you to come back. I wasn't quite done with your body yet. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. See, I wasn't quite done with your body yet is the issue. I don't want to go down this hallway, man. All right. Well, we got to get you back on the gurney here, friend. Oh. Uh, okay. Should I go around the back? You know what? Maybe we go around the back. Yeah, what if we What if we take this the long way? <laughs> no! Where am I not going? What if I go this way? Okay, well, they didn't like that very much. Um, can I go this way? Nope, that just makes the tiles disintegrate. All right. All right, none of these doors work. None of these doors, okay. Real fake doors. Got a classroom over here by the looks of it. I'm assuming I gotta make it to that doorway. Uh, this is nice linear progression we got going here. Is that our dead dad? Yeah, well, it's his fault for not wearing grippy shoes on a rainy day, all right? I mean, come on. Hiking boots. Not that hard, Dad. Figure it out. Okay. Is there a key? Yeah, I'm... I don't... I... I can't... I can't... I can't open the door, man. You know what? No, you know what? They say not to, not to talk to strangers. Ah! High risk. You know what? Why not? Why not, right? You know, we... Listen, listen. We're already... At, that's not it. Okay. Cool. Um. Then we're not we're not going to the high risk. Then Appar apparently that's 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 a thing we're skipping. That's you know what? Honestly, fine with me. Feel like we've taken enough risks. Is this some pills? Antidepressants. Tacos and sushi. Tacos and sushi. Antidepressants. Um. Do I have to take these? Where do I? I can't go either of those ways. See, everything's kind of screaming, go to the high risk door right now, right? But like, I couldn't open it. Do I have to bring my antidepressants over here? Uh, uh-huh. None of these work. Cool, I don't have, I couldn't pick up the spare keys. So that's not even an option I I could, I could have. Oh, do I have to deal with the loss of my father? I don't. Can I loot something from this that I can use? No, no, okay. You're telling me I was supposed to figure out walking over the black space? Oh my God. Give me the spare keys. All right, let's go, let's go. High risk, where was the, did, did, did they just, did they just do the thing? Oh boy, it's already risky. All right. Hi, I'm new here. Uh, could you show me around? Is this whole thing gonna be, how about I'm actually already dead? I'm sitting here holding your coin right now, wondering if I'll ever have one of my own. What would the point even be? Even if one day I'm sitting here holding my own, no matter how many years are printed on it, I would still always have yours in my other hand, never changing, stuck forever. It would always remind me of the life I cut short while I keep going. I can't imagine it. So that's our suicide note. Necklace, my dad's necklace. Okay, we can't, we can't take that. And I'm assuming my dad years, yep, five year sobriety coin, which we have on us. So I don't really have to worry about that. Um, very impressive that you, your rigor mortis managed to, I'm assuming that's 10 year sobriety coin and then 
You're the other, the, oh, I have to give her the, don't I have, I, I, I feel like, yeah, I have to give her the, I have to give her the, the five-year coin. I can't use that here. What do you mean I can't? That's literally, I can't use that here. that's literally exactly what they're asking me to do. There isn't a day I don't think about you. Memories still flash in my mind, uninvited in a moment of bliss, torn down by unimaginable guilt. Nothing they give me helps. I still have your necklace. It's one of the few things uh, they let keep me in here. I'm not sure I can handle having it anymore, though. I'm giving it to grandma uh, when she visits next. I want so badly to have the piece of you with me, but I'm afraid of it. Uh, I don't deserve it. Uh, you told me that when I was little, I will put it around your neck every morning as a way to wake you up. I guess my kids, uh, I guess kids just like shiny things and annoying their parents. I don't really remember it much. I just remember you being annoyed with me after the hundredth time, but I would give you, I would give you anything to put it around your neck one last time to see you wake up. Pretty dark, man. I need to, ah, hi. Ah. Okay, well, no, oh, all right. That's bad. And we're home. Question, is the white man back on the thingy yet? I have a feeling I probably need a sigil in here, but I already know the demon's name, so we're just not gonna worry about that. Ah, he is, that's lovely. So you ready to, uh, ready to finish up here? Here's what we're gonna do. Here, for the rest, for the rest of this, we're gonna we're, we're gonna take this mark. Uh, we're at, I mean, I mean, come on, let's let's all let's all be let's all be entirely real with ourselves here. Come on. Uh, I, yeah, we're gonna keep that on you. So I'm pretty sure it's in that guy. That being said, so this, this should keep the demonic spirit in there. So if anything demonic happens while that mark is on him, then, then we're, cause we know it's not in Christine because we put the mark on Christine and then there was still more demonic activity. So if nothing demonic happens while that mark is on him, then that's a pretty good, pretty good hint that, 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 that's our demon. I think that's it. That's at least a pretty good way to think about it. Cool. All done there. We just gotta get you nice and sliced open now. Uh, artery forceps, PVC tubing, and you are good to lose all your blood, sir. Let's get you nice and pumped out. While we're waiting on that, we can take an uh, empty bag and we'll fill that with fluid. You know, I actually feel pretty good because I'm pretty sure that's the deep. Are you gonna take the key off yourself? What's over there? Oh goodness. All right, that was a straight up awful frame drop. So we're playing at 30 frames per second now. So, I mean, if it looks a bit choppier, I apologize. I have no idea what's happened. We're playing at 4K, 60 FPS with V-Sync on this entire time, but absolutely fine. So he's pointing that way. Might as well. This hallway get longer. God damn it, I'm in the back rooms. Okay, cool. Is this infinite? Is this forever? Do I live in a hallway now? What is this, Final Fantasy 13? Hello? Ah, God has left you. I don't think God was ever with me, TBH. Mmm. God has left you. See, feel like I shouldn't walk towards her. Ah, there's a wall there now. So that's my only option is to walk towards her. Okay, well, you know, that's what we got. Do you want, hey, listen, do you want a bag? I have an IV reservoir bag. I even have a clipboard that could, it could be yours. You just stay. Okay, well, that works as well. Um, Can I also go through the wall? I can't. So I'm just, I just live in this hallway now. You know, we tried, that's all that matters. So how do we leave the hallway with no doors? Ho! 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 Let's check in. Mmm, that's a sigil. I think that's that's one of the that's one of the demonic sigils is I think that's try I think they're trying to no, nope. okay, that's is it nothing? Uh tools of expulsion. Got it. We're we're, we're going to grab some more of these just in case. Just in yeah, just in case we need them, you know. Ho! Okay, that was quick. What? Oh. Hold up. All right, that's the Rossang gun, and the other one was a kanji mark. So yeah, it's Uzka, it's Uzka Man. Okay. What do I have to do? Engage pump and let the body drain. The body, the body's drained. I, I really, I really think it's this guy, man. I really think, I think it's, I think it's this guy. But there has been some demonic activity. I mean, it was him. It was him that moved. Uh, 
what do I have to do next? I gotta, I gotta fill an empty. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got, I got, I got a bag. I got a bag. I don't know, man. Can we just burn this body? Like, I don't, oh. Like, is it the end of the world if I burn two bodies? I guess the problem is I have to burn the body with the, with the, with the thingy on it. So if I, if I burn it, then there goes our key. It's not, it's not the other. It's, it's, it's either this or the other guy. It's not the girl. I feel like we don't need to embalm this dude fully. We could just burn him. That would work as well. But I feel like this game wants me to do the rest of the embalming here. There, there, there we go. Like we're not dealing with demons trying to murder us. Yep, there we go. Let's go get some. Let's go get some cleaners. It's not like we had to deal with our dead father last time we went or anything like that. You know, let's test the floor. Good. No blood. All right. Ha! Bitch. Okay. Well, I'm starting to feel like there's too much demonic activity out here to say that we got the right guy pinned in there. What if we, what if we hold on to this? I don't, should we get, should we put this guy away for a second and see if the, if I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I know it's not Christine, man. I know it's not Christine. We gotta apply moisturizer to this dude. I'm gonna put this guy like in his cold storage and then I'm gonna pull the other guy out and we're just gonna do one last final check on him. We got everybody embalmed. That's all that matters. But this guy ran at us. Yeah, get all nice and moist. Turn body to cold storage. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna take this mark. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take this mark. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna put this guy in cold storage. Easy as that, man. Easy as that. Then we just gotta take the other guy out. We gotta take the other guy out. We still have this old key, man, and I don't know what this old key is for. All right, all right, all right. We're gonna take the we're gonna we're we're gonna put you in there. Uh huh. Um, that feels suspicious. That felt very suspicious. We'll put the mark on this guy real quick. We'll see if he has any additional any additional markings. I'll read I'll read what he had. Okay, let's let's first off, first first and foremost, let's feel wrong, you know. Am I though? Because that's new. Because that's new. Am I wrong though? I gotta get his I gotta get his report. Actually, no, I can I can I can just I can just I can read his report online. I can read his report on the computer. Nathan Kelly. Whoa, can I all right, exit out, exit out, exit out. Uh, record system. Nathan Kelly had a mole on his on so on his right arm, he only had blemishes. On his right arm, he had blemishes. Now on his right arm, he's got this sigil and he's got blemishes. That's different. That's that's new. It's him. It's gotta be him, man. It's gotta be him. Yeah. He didn't have that before. He didn't have that before. Oh, it's you. I'm burning you, big boy. Oh, it is you, homie. Into the fire you go, big guy. Sorry, friend. Hello? Why isn't that opening? No, 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 no. I don't, why would I have to do this again? No, hold up. Why would I, I there, there's no reason. I, he's already embalmed. I've done him. I've done him. Why can't I turn this on? How do I fire up the incinerator? Huh? Huh? Okay. Bro, how do I fire up the incinerator? That needs to be closed. This is bad. Surely I don't have to re-embalm this dude. All right, come on, you're coming back with me. Oh! Bro, we need to burn this motherfucker! Man, there's gotta be, there's gotta be something. There's gotta be something in here that I'm just missing. Oh wait, the bags. Cremation bag, a plastic bag used for storing the ashes of cremated bodies. Okay. Should I, hello? Okay, so I probably have to put this in in there what did i just do what did i did i did i just did i just what did i do ashes do i why do i have oh wait 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 do we read a thing we read a thing about ashes didn't we? we 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 read we read the 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 book thing the book thing had ashes in it if i'm not mistaken the book typhon charred remains of derod and walks his bible spreading his ash up spreading his ash hold up hold up no 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 what, what else? okay hold up so should i Okay, I have his ash. I have ash on you. Hold up, I should put the mark back on him. I should put the mark back on him. I have ash on him. Now, now that I have ash on him, what do I have to do? Saw mark burn, burn. Saw mark burned deep into their flesh. Burned. The matches. Oh, my my matches. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Hold up. Uh, one, one left. One, one left. Okay. Do I have to light these ashes on fire? Okay. Wait, so things have been, so, so this whole time, oh, wait, that looks like, wait, that kind of looks like, oh, okay. 
because my insanity has been scribbling things and I, should they, should it be the same or should it be different? I feel like this is telling me like how far I'm possessed, right? So that, that might tell me what the right demon is. Okay, so I don't, maybe it's not. That's definitely not the same. Was I wrong? Is it not him? Was he being truthful when he said I was wrong? Oh my God, what if it is the dude? What if it is the dude? Oh, but I don't, I don't, I don't have any more matches. I can't, I can't check. Okay, hold up. I, so it's not, so it's not this guy. Okay, hold up. That's the wrong, that's the wrong place. Oh man. Oh man. Okay, okay, right, right. let's get you. Let's get you. I don't, I guess if you, if you, I'm assuming they have to line up. Otherwise, like them just being different probably wouldn't make a whole lot of sense game wise. All right, I need the mark back. So I don't, I don't think it's you. So you don't get to, you don't get demonically burned today. I, that only leaves this guy. That only leaves this guy. I mean, th th there's no way it was Christine. She did nothing. She did nothing weird. Yeah, you don't want me to take you, do you? You don't want me to take you, do you? Does he have any extra markings on him? He's got nothing weird. That's my thing is there's nothing, there's nothing new on him. He had that bruise. I don't, I don't have any more ashes. I don't, I, I can't, I, I don't, I don't think this, this bit doesn't work again. Because I only had one match. I can't grab a cremation back. I don't know what I need. I just don't know how to open the incinerator. Maybe I, maybe I, I don't know. Maybe he's just like, maybe, I mean, a lot of this game has been like location locked. Like you have to like, Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Get in there, demon. Oh, you're pissed. Oh, you're pissed. Please be the right body. That was the wrong body, wasn't it? No. Screaming. Is that the day I did it? Oh. Oh, no. Does fire not kill demons? No, you know, no, I did everything right. Back, back, no, oh. Literally, let's go, let's. Demon banished, baby. Demon banished, I think, hopefully, maybe, I don't. Nice not to be the one down there for a change. What do you, what do you, what do you mean, where? Raymond? Down where? I suppose a first name basis is in order. Oh, no, is it over? I'm leaving. What do you mean? You've come a long way. It's a lot to learn. How often do you have to do this? What? I know it's disorienting. You'll get used to it. How are you not haunted? You should head home and get some rest. Every night you can get that. I think I'm fine. This is not worth any amount of money. What? What do you mean I chose the wrong demon? No, that was absolutely the right demon. Well, he was a bad boss. Demons banished. Zero. I saw a demon get burned. Ending three out of, there's five endings. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I bet. I could have swore that was the right demon. Maybe I put the, I put the stones in the wrong confirmation. That shouldn't matter. Oh, that's so aggravating. Oh, that drives me insane. Oh, I thought I did so good. I was so calm confident oh well whatever regardless that game was legitimately terrifying i haven't played a game that scary in a long long time oh my goodness i just hate paranormal stuff man i, I don't believe in ghosts or any of that it just scares me but thank you guys for checking in today i really appreciate you watching this edition of nc gamer 23 if you guys like what you saw tell me in the comments below if you want more horror games or different horror games tell me what horror games you guys want i would love to play them and while you guys are in those comments, please, for me, like this video, subscribe to the page, and hit that noti bell.